So I'm going to be showing you guys, well I might as well show you now that I'm pretty much done, uh, how to put, where to really place your GPS and where the best place could be. You could either tuck it behind here, which will look kind of weird from the outside, so I'm going to leave it symmetrical and kind of put it like this. Because I would put it on the windshield, but you see the black, the black right there. It's not really going to work. So then, this slides down and comes, I don't know if you can see that, slides up and down. See, up, down, up. It's going to be a little tight after you put the other cable in because it's only meant for the one for the, for the mirror. So, once you do that, you can actually feed the wire and hide it on this little trim right here and just follow it all the way down to the A pillar which is right here for a nice clean look we're just gonna tuck it in there and I took off the weather stripping you do not need to take off the A pillar it's probably a mistake that a lot of people are gonna do or want to do but you take off the weather stripping you just kind of hide the wire and as you can see where I fed it through you don't even need anything. Wire comes out of there and it goes down here. Kind of feeds up a little bit. Oh, that's blurry. I don't know why that's blurry. Weird. So let's, let me give you an idea. Starts from here where you plug it in. You could even start here first and then work your way down. I did it backwards because I already had it installed and I didn't want to go through the trouble of taking the stereo back out. So I fed it through the glove box down underneath this cover. You can see that, so it's above this cover. And then up and around through the side, I took off the weather trimming. I didn't really do anything else. Took off the weather trimming, went up through the A-pillar. You might want to like squeeze something right here. Don't take it off though. That'll probably mess it up because um, of the airbag right here. And uh, probably don't want to take that off or trigger that. Then feed it through the weather stripping up here. Unhook this, clip it, and then I'm going to double-sided tape it right there. So that it just peeks over, peeks right over that, just a little bit. I mean, the MDX has it like right here. Oh, that one over there has it like right here, and it's just dangling like right on the windshield, and it looks kind of weird. But I think it's blacked out from the front, so it doesn't look that weird. But from the inside, it looks kind of weird. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna put it right here because it's probably the best spot for the GPS signal to get the best signal. I mean, it, I used it and it, it did get a good signal inside the glove box, but that just that's just kind of ghetto. And uh, I'm trying to have a, a cleaner look here in the car, so that wasn't going to do for me. Anyway, that's it for this short video on where to place your antenna. I'm going to double-sided tape that, and that'll be the end of that. Thank you guys for watching. I'll keep you guys posted when I do the backup camera. I am going to have to take this apart again. So if you don't know how to remove your stereo and don't know how to install this one, I'll definitely, definitely shoot you guys a video for that too.